The National Park Service has confirmed that all five people on board a small plane that crashed on the Outer Banks have died. Four adults and one child were, were killed when the plane crashed into a wooded area around 5 p.m. Saturday at Wright Brothers National Memorial's first flight airport. The National Transportation Safety Board says the plane was attempting to land on runway 21 at the airport, but did not land on the first approach. The crash occurred during the second approach and the plane caught on fire. The fire was put out by the Kill Devils Hills Fire Department and other fire departments. According to the FAA, the plane was a single engine Cirrus SR-22. The NTSB and the FAA are investigating this crash.